Hi, my name is Patrick, and today we'll be talking about the Atom Text Editor's integrated Git and GitHub tools. Come join me. You can see I have my GitHub page that was forked from Lambda School's repository. And on this page, just uh, to point out that you will see the latest commit messages, and uh, you will also see when they were made. Just a quick way to make sure everything's up to date. And in the text editor for this responsive web design project, I'm going to open up the index.html and add a little h1 tag. And then we will go ahead and save the file. And now Git will see that this has there's been a change to the project. And you can see in green something's been added. And double-clicking it, I add it, and I can double-click it and unstage it. It's like using the git add commands, but if I do the git status in red, hasn't been staged, double-click it, git status again, it's in green, it has been staged. So the exact same command's going on there. So now that it's staged, I can add a commit message. In the first line, I put an informational, succinct title. And that can be enough. Try and keep it under 50 words. As you see in the corner, it's counting down. But if you add a new line in a paragraph, that's another way to add a body to a message. And then I just click and commit. Now if I check git status, I will see that my local repository is ahead of what's on the GitHub repository. So now I want to push it up. And at the click of a button, I access the menu. And now GitHub is loading it up onto the cloud. So as soon as that's done, if I get status again, then I can see that I'm up to date with what's on GitHub.